April 95. Um, okay, so we're gonna do kind of a, a dip cribs type thing. It's not, it's not gonna be crazy like Outlaws because I don't have a cameraman here. I'm just gonna kind of show you my room, talk about a little bit of shit. Let's go. Okay, so we start over here. Here's my crutches from when my foot was broken. Got my John Deere picky bank. Hell yes. Little calendar. Got my closet. You know. Got my cut off sleeve flannel. Regular flannel. Sweatshirts. Flannels. Just jeans. Carhartts. T shirts. Cowboy shirts. Got it all. Fucking Coors Light sign. This was given to me by Eugene Bullrider. It's got all the teams on there. There is a hog mount. Wearing a squirrel shooting hat. Uh, my dad, he uh, he shot that boar in California, I believe. Anyway, uh, this was my second buck I ever killed. That was in Montana. There's the first one, Dayton, Washington. The, Mon the Montana one had a little bit bigger of a body, but the, the Dayton one, I think, tasted better. Okay, here's my curtain. That, that second blanket right there, it blocks the sun. And under that, I got my rebel flag. Gotta show my pride, you know. Uh, I got some autograph Raiders and A's shit over here. Yes, I'm from Oakland, so gotta rep my, my uh, home city, I guess. <laughs> got some uh, old signs over there. Just a bunch of stuff. Some grouse tail feathers. Got a couple of die cast NASCARs. There's the tattoo I'm gonna get right there. There's a Dale Jr. die cast. Jack Daniels case for my belt buckle, which I do not have on, or else I would show you. Uh, there's an Indian grinder. My cowboy hat. And a spitter. Thank God. And a picture of me when I was a little some bitch fishing with my dad. Mm, got my unfinished dip tower over here. This sticker right here was sent to me by Darcy for free. Just threw it in the package. Got a red man. Golden blend, that's the shit. Homemade pen, motherfuckers. Look at that shit. Mallard. Uh, here's my TV, the highlight of my room. It was given to me by my brother, who lives in uh, Oregon now. It's my Xbox, got a few games. Okay, you're gonna say, why is there a redneck playing Saints Row? My guy on Saints Row is a fucking redneck, okay? Here's my, uh, oh, there's a couple racks, topless racks, you know what I'm saying? Got a moose rack. No, I didn't shoot this, my dad did. I shot both of these and that sucker up there. There's some arrowheads that my dad found in, uh, I think, Arizona. I found the case that's in the middle there. My mom helped me arrange them when I was like five or something, so they're in a smiley face. Got a no Western ammunition cartridge. Or not. What the fuck am I saying? It's an ammunition box. There's my hunting pack. Bunch of hunting shit over here. Got some guns in here. Probably do another video on those. Got a 12 gauge, 22, and a pellet gun in there. A few lids that I did a lid trick to. Um, got some full mud jugs down here. Ah, get this sucker so you can see it. Redneck Nation mud jug. This one's nasty. This is full of a brim. Confederate camo mud jug. And, of course, Blaze Orange Mud Jug. There's my couch. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much my room. It's more of a man cave than a room, I guess. Uh, pretty much. Okay, so what happened was, right here where this couch is, 
was where there was a wall and my sister lived on the other side and when she moved out my dad just let me demo out that whole fucking wall so now instead of a small ass room I went to a giant ass man cave <laughs> oh I didn't show you this gun this is my old 410 so this was my grandma's gun this thing was fucking sick as hell just a single barrel it's badass So that's pretty much that. I'll probably do another video on my guns. Um, yeah, and just just for the hell of it, I'll say this: you know you're a redneck when you got your Christmas lights up year round. Subscribe.